What's up everybody, it's The Roar, and here I am today for my 100th video, 100. Super excited, so happy, and I'm so glad you guys are coming along for the ride. Can you guess where I am? Take a look. Any guesses? That's right. I am here at Arlington National Cemetery, right here filming my 100th video. And what we're doing today is we're gonna go walk around the park, go up these stairs right here, and we're gonna look at some famous graves right here throughout. Look at this, I thought I could get across here, but I can't. <laughs> this is an awesome memorial. I think this is, no, this isn't the Women's Memorial. I saw a sign this way, but I think it's on top of the stairs. But how cool. We are going to spend the day right here filming Arlington Cemetery. Come join me. Let's roll. So up here, I gotta be quiet. You're supposed to be silent throughout this whole area right here. You can see it up here. So from this forward, I'm just gonna do videos and not talk. Okay, so now that we're from that area, they ask for quiet, silence, and respect, and that's what I did. Once you walk up those stairs, you you do not talk. So, uh, out of respect, I did not do anything on the video, but when you saw there, the grave sites, it was Patrick Kennedy, uh, JFK, Jacqueline Onassis, and then their daughter, which I think was a stillborn, uh, because it was born and died the same day. So, but right here is RFK and Ted Kennedy. Right here. Junior's web or gravesite. I said website. <laughs> so next is Ted Kennedy's web gravesite. Let's do it again. Right here. Take a 
Okay, look at this. I'm gonna show you guys something. Look at this. You can pause it to read it. But beneath this giant stone right here, in this garden, are 2,111 unknown soldiers. The bones of the unknown soldiers from the Battle of Bull Run and the route to Rappahannock. They were able to uh, lo locate the bones, but not identify who they were. So this is a, a memorial and a monument to them. And by the way, thank you to all of those who have, who have paid the ultimate price. And your 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 thankfulness or your I don't even know what the, your reward could be. You could be buried right here in Olinton Cemetery. And what a beautiful cemetery it is! One of the most beautiful I've ever seen. All right, let's go take a look at some other. All right, guys, I found them. Take a look. See this? I talked to someone from Arlington Cemetery. They said you can go through here, and LaFont is buried right back here. Take a look at this. Look at this. view this man has this is LaFont believe it I am mad excited about this this is LaFont who is the name the metro station is named after LaFont Plaza he designed he is the architect of Washington DC how would you like to have this view for eternity look right here that's the, uh, the memorial for JFK, RFK. It's so awesome. Take a look at his gravesite. is a map that is the map of Washington DC and right there is the old R Robert or no 
General Lee, R. F. R. Robert E. Lee, in his house. Now, supposedly, he's buried around here too. So I talked to someone who is with Arlington Cemetery. They said, you can walk up here. You know, these sites are open to anybody for walking up. And uh, it's really cool. I'm really excited to be up here. I'm super stoked. So I'm not gonna go any further because that is actually cut, uh, crossed off and everything else, but yeah. This is amazing. Just think about here in DC, that man designed everything in DC. That is one of the best views in the area back there. It is. <laughs> I was trying to, I've been trying to find him. That is Taft's gravesite. Right up this path. Let's go take a look. Look at this. Alright, so sorry about that. I had to end the video a little early. That was not Taff. He might be related to Taff. Not entirely sure. It looks like he is a man in the military. He was in the military. I don't know. Taft's uh, family is still in politics to this day. If you remember, one of the governors, former governor of Ohio back in the early 2000s or 1990, he was a relative of Taft. He was the governor of Ohio. So, the family is big enough. Where are they gonna do that? Here he is. The Chief Justice. Because he was the Supreme Court Justice, as well as President. William Howard Taft. So, again, I ended the video abruptly. So I noticed a line of string of cars coming up and it was indeed a funeral. So we have to respect the rules when we come here. So hey, did I ever tell you this is my 100th video? <laughs> I am super stoked. And I hope this is a great video. Again, I'm gonna edit it. When I get home, I've been editing all day. This might be a two-part series. I am not entirely sure. But we will see. But I was told that Evans is right down this path. So let's go see that. And we'll end the video with that. And the last person for the video we're going to get is Medgar W. Evers. Evers, not Evans. That was my bad. This whole time, that was Medgar Evans. It's Medgar Evers. He was a, he was in World War II. And from what I understand, from the tram that went by, said it was an officer in World War II. Um, Medgar Evers. He's also, when he was in Mississippi, uh, he was getting, from what I understand, he was coming out of his car where he was gunned down in his carport in front of his family. It's very, very sad of the times that used to, used to be. We couldn't all just get along, you know? It's very, very sad. But that man right there, in a way, has died for freedom. It's very, and if you ever come down here, this is section 36 of the cemetery, and he is actually 
right there in a uh, in a row by himself. So it's very sad. May he rest in peace. It's crazy, and that is that will conclude my video here at Arlington Cemetery. But before we leave, or before I end it, I just off the corner of my eye, I see this. What do you think this could be? I just have no idea. It looks like a sealed off drainage from, from way back, way back uh, in the day. It also looks like it might be an unmarked grave. There is no, there's no documentation here. There's no signage here of who that could be. Who do you think may be buried in there? If it is a gravesite, or if it's just a old, old drainage system from around that, uh, that they sealed up. I mean, I just don't, I just don't know. It'd be interesting to find out. Maybe I'll find out on the way out of here. That marks the first half of the video of Arlington Cemetery. I don't know if there will be a second half. Because I think I cover a lot of the famous sites that are here. And I hope that you enjoy it. Do not forget to subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications. And thank you for joining me on my 100th video. Let's try to get to 100 more. Adios.